Hey, Daniel Hall here. I just built a custom GPT that people would actually pay to use. And it took me roughly about 15 minutes. No coding, no technical skills. Just copy, paste, and answer some questions. Want to see exactly how I did it? Look, everyone's talking about AI, but most people just are playing around with chat GPT prompts, having no idea how to actually make money with this AI stuff. Meanwhile, smart entrepreneurs are building custom GPTs that solve real problems for their clients. The issue? Most people think you need to be some sort of engineer, prompt engineer to build one of these that actually works. Guess what? Yeah, I don't, okay? I'm about to show you in a conversational system that builds professional custom GPTs for you. All you gotta do is answer some questions and it generates everything, the instructions, the setup guide, even it even tells you exactly what to paste and where, okay? Now I'm going to build a real custom GPT right now live on camera using nothing but this generator. Basically, we'll go from zero to a professional AI assistant in under 30 minutes. And I'll show you exactly how people are turning these into valuable products and services that you can sell for a profit. Plus, I'll share how you can get this exact generator system at the end of this video. So you ready? Okay, let's build something that could transform how you deliver and profit from your expertise. Let's jump in right now. So here is the custom GPT that I have coded up for you and it starts right down here and it goes on for about seven pages. So I'm gonna actually grab this and open up and I just want you to notice here, I've got two chat GPT tabs right up over at the top here and you should open this up when you go to use this generator yourself. So on this very first tab, I'm going to paste in our generator. And again, it's a long generator, so it takes sometimes a while. And let me get this so that you can actually see it nice and big for us. And we're gonna bring that down and it's uh, doing its thing. It just, uh, it's, it's thinking, so let's let it do that. Great. So now it's asking, hey, what's your niche? Well, for me, I'm going to write in here self-publishing for you, you're gonna write in whatever your niche is, okay? And I'm going to let it cook here. Now it's going to ask our second question here, a audience question. In other words, who are my audience? Or who is the audience that you are trying to create an AI solution for? For me, I have beginners, intermediate, and pros in my audience, so I'm gonna choose four, which is mixed. It's all of them, basically, and I'm going to answer four there. And that's why I've, I've, I've actually designed this system, so all you really have to do is, is pretty much just answer the questions with a number or a letter, and it goes, makes it super easy, doesn't have you, you know, having to think a lot. So it, it, it makes it super, super fast this way. So in the next thing it says, hey, a quick qualifier for the outcome. Well, I want this one. I want a, I want a, a GPT, a custom GPT that actually does coaching for my audience. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna choose four here and keep on trucking. And it's going to cook a little further. Now it's now it wants uh, it wants to now know what the deliverable is. So again, I because I want this to be basically coach for my folks. I'm going to answer four step by step because that's what a good coach will do. So we're going to do that and let it cook. Now the next thing it wants to know is what tone do do you want the GPT the custom GPT to to speak in? I'm going to take do number one here for clear and professional and it will do its thing once again. But the other thing I want you to understand as well is that you could have put in custom with any of these. You you can do basically, you could do both playful and friendly or playful friendly and analyst or, or anything else you wanna do. So each one of these is meant not just to do what the defaults are there are the suggestions but but five is always a custom or there's always a custom that's available 
Now, again, it's still thinking for poten potential names for GPT. And here we go. We've got self-publishing coach GPT, the indie author launch coach, and the self-pub playbook book to market coach and the KDP self-publishing coach. And it gives us some description options as well. So at all of these, we want to know, it, would, it tells you what it wants, basically. You're going to put in reply with a name, number, and description number. So we're going to choose, let's see, we're gonna do five for KDP and beyond. And we want to do, let's see, your step-by-step -step coach playing, marketing a book, clear, professional guidance, and let's see, no fluff coach that turns goals into step-by-step -step plans across writing, production, distribution, and marketing, mixed level guidance. I think I'm gonna take do three here for this one and keep on trucking. Okay, so now it has actually given us our, our name and our description, and what it wants us to do is to actually start building our custom GPT. So now we go on to our second tab. Remember, we opened two here at the beginning. We're going to go to that second tab here and we're going to go to where it says GPT. So I, I opened up the sidebar and I'm going down to GPTs and then over from here, it wants to know here you can, you hit create and this is where you start to actually put in the information for your custom GPT. So now it's saying, hey, put in your name, copy the name and copy and we're gonna put that in there paste and then we're going to go back and we're going to grab our our description and we're going to go back to our description and click paste awesome and by the way it says configure so not not create but configure that's what it says right here right then once you've done that click done or type done so we're going to reply done because we've done that see it's very very simple very step by step just follow what it tells you to do and you will not go wrong. You are likely will not have any problem at all. Now it wants you to pick a persona. And I think I'm gonna go with number two, supportive mentor, and choose that as my choice there. Okay, now it wants us to pick a function. So let's see, coach planner, diagnose, goal, step-by-step -step plan, plus checklist, or launch coach, timeline from pre-order to 30 days post-launch, or distribution coach, KDP, plus wide distribution, setup paths, that's interesting. Marketing sprint coach, weekly repeatable promo sprints. Ooh, that sounds good, actually, because I, I know authors have a problem with that. So I'm actually gonna go with that one. So I'm gonna choose four and keep on trucking. Okay, the next thing it wants us to do is our pick our constraints. And it says basically default guardrails, metrics mode, hands-on, and it basically gives you a, you know, how you want your responses or, or how it you want it, its responses to to be delivered for me let's see we want to see let's see hands-on imperative steps include tiny copy and paste blocks examples Ooh, that's pretty good i think i'm going to go with three if you have these other ones but i like three a lot for what i have in mind for this custom gpt so we're going to choose three and let it think now in this section under constraints, it wants to know or help you choose conversation starters. In other words, a conversation starter is a easy box for a person who's using your custom GPT to just click and it starts the conversation. And it, you could start with any questions like this. What's your book audience and launch date? Give me your current marketing assets and links. Design a seven day print for pre-order starting next Monday. Audit my metadata for KDP and wide distribution, plan a four week post-launch review, advanced reader copy strategy, outline a you know a $1 promo stack I could run this weekend, turn these comps into positioning and, and hooks and then, turn, uh, and then paste the links. So I really like, let's see, I like two, I like three, and like five and six five and six okay so we're going to choose those like and once again you could start with whatever conversations you want but again i've designed this so that it's easy it takes very little mental bandwidth for you to actually go through the process and of course any of these 
any of these responses can be customized and tweaked and 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 and, and really honed in on the subtleties of your particular business, your particular niche. Okay, that's what I want you to understand ab about the flexibility of this GPT builder. So let's let this think. All right, so now it's telling us to go on to uh, the next part of it, which is our instructions. So it wants us to, to copy these instructions. And by the way, it's telling us that this is its final instructions. So we're gonna grab all of this. Oops, all of that, there we go. And we're gonna go back over to our other tab where we're building our custom GPT and we're gonna go down to where it says instructions and put it in this form field right here, just paste it just like that, okay? Now, kind of scrolling down down here, it wants our conversation starters and fortunately we have those right here as well. So we've got one, copy it, paste it, and then opens up this window below. And we're going to grab this and copy paste. And we're going to do this for all four of these and paste and one more paste. Now going back to our generator it says, Hey, paste into instructions and conversation starter, then reply done. Well, we've done that. So I'm going to plot reply done. It's going to cook for a while. So the next thing it wants us to do is go to our capabilities and it looks like uh, browsing is off code interpreters off image is off and canvas is off so they're all off so let's uh, go over here and here are the capabilities so let's go ahead and grab just toggle all of those off and now it wants to it says hey then reply done well we've done that and keep on trucking okay now this is optional. This is the options pack as it says here. Each voice gives one short paragraph to append to the end of instructions. Do you want a tone booster, a supportive mentor, encourage briefly, then drive action, use nice, lock this, pro tip, stuck, do X, or content strategy and SEO. For each sprint, add three hooks, three long tails, H2, H3 tag, outline, etc. advanced research layer, etc. So for me, what I want is the, the tone booster supportive mentor. I'm going to choose that one. And it's going to now go about writing those additional instructions here that we're going to then append to the end of our instructions form field. So it goes kind of right below where we put in earlier those instructions in earlier. So let's let it cook here. So here, yeah, here are our additional instructions. And it says, hey, paste this at the end of the instructions and then click apply done. So let's go ahead and do that. We're gonna grab this, copy it. We're gonna go back to that other tab where we're working. I'm gonna go scroll back up and we're going to find the very bottom of the instructions, which is right here. Here's the instructions. We're gonna go to the very bottom of all of our instructions here and we're gonna click paste and put the, that in there. Awesome, now we're gonna go back to our other tab, our generator tab, and click type in here, done. It's going to think for a moment. Now it does this really nice final field by field checklist to make sure that you've got all of these already done and it's all here. So we've got KDP and beyond self-publishing coach. We've done that. We've done this copy description and here are our final instructions there. Awesome. Our conversation starters and it gives you an idea for a profile pic. I'll show you an, an easier way to, to deal with that in just a second. We've toggled off all our capabilities here, custom actions we've left blank. Now, basically when everything is pasted and toggled, click publish and it actually it's now it's changed to create. But let me show you what that's all about. So we're gonna go back over here and I just know that we have put everything in here, right? Our name, our description, our instructions, our conversation starters and our capabilities. And we are pretty much done with that. Now, one last thing, and that is the little icon, the little logo that goes with this. And the really cool thing is, is you could upload your own. So if you had, you know, brand colors or a, a logo that, already fit your business, you could upload it, put it in there, or you could simply use Dali to create a, a logo here for specifically for this custom GPT. So I'm gonna do that. 
let it let it do its thing here. And here we go. And I like this coach dashboard. Let's see, KDP, KDP. Cool. Since this is a KDP and beyond self-publishing coach. Now we get to do the fun part. We get to publish this. We do that by coming up where, where it says create. And for us, we're going to choose anyone with the link. Now, here's the deal. If you're going to sell this, if you're going to sell it, then ch you choose anyone with the link. If you are going to use this as a lead generator, you perhaps might want to include it in the, ch the, 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 the chat GPT store. Okay, where people could find you and find it or and use it for free. But for most of us, we want it hidden. We want just the, that we are selling it to, to have access to it. And if that describes you, we're going to click save and it's going to give us our, our GPT. So this is the, the, the link that you will put in your, on your thank you page and your PDF deliverable. This is where you're going to send people that buy this from you, in other words. So we're gonna actually gonna go go use this bad boy. I'm gonna click GPT, view, view GPT. Let's make this a little smaller so you can kind of see what it looks like. There you go. And make it a little larger again. Okay, so now you can kind of see how the whole thing has come together, right? So it, it's got our nice logo up here that we created, our, the title of it, KDP and Beyond Self-Publishing Coach, the description of what this thing does, and it even gives us some initial conversation starters. So I, want, I like this one. I wanna try this one just to show you how it works. Outline a $0 promo stack I can run this weekend. Great. So it's going to do, it's going to take all of that combined wisdom and do what we want it to do in the tone that we want it to, to do it in as a coach to really help our folks along, or in my case, you all <laughs> to help you all along in, in this quest. Now, the other cool thing about these custom GPTs is you don't have to start with this conversation. You can start with any conversation, right? That relates to KDP or and or self-publishing, self et cetera. So this is a super useful tool to create an AI solution that you could then sell. And the other cool thing about this and I, that I absolutely love about these things is you know that if somebody's using this bad boy, that they're getting value from it. That if you're selling access to it, you're actually doing good in the world, right? You're actually delivering on your promise to 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 help somebody. And why that's important is it, at least for me, it clears any cognitive dissonance out of my psyche so that I, I can go like really like full on in promoting whatever it is that, that I'm doing. And so can you, because you know that this is really, really good stuff. So again, here's uh, what, what this thing just kicked out at us. Let's see, you could stack real uh, real reach this weekend. Let's run on a tight, tight $1 sprint. Download spike and review ask. Let's see, seven days, KDP, select free days or free book funnel, prolific works page, Canva, universal link. Those are your inputs. Day one, uh, this is less than 45 minutes. Lock in a 40, 48 hour free on KDP, make universal link. Draft your first email and three socials. And let's see, day two, et cetera, et cetera. So there you go. This is, again, just one very, very fast example of how this bad boy works. And of course, it could do a heck of a lot more. But I wanted to show you this. And by the way, we're done creating the whole thing. And I've demoed what we've created all in less than 25 minutes, okay? So if you want access to our custom GPT builder, this one right here, right around where you see this video. There's a, there's gonna be a link, okay? Maybe it's right below where you're not watching. Maybe it's above, maybe it's in the description. I'm not sure because I'm not sure where we're posting this video, but somewhere around here, there's gonna be a link where you can go grab this custom GPT and we've got it on special right now. Now, so go ahead and grab it while the grabbing is good. And I would love to hear what you create with this. I wanna see your custom GPTs. I want to see what you create. So let us know in the description, let us know in the comments how you like this, if you've got questions, et cetera, et cetera. And 
and this is important, make sure if you have not yet subscribed to the channel that, that you do that right now and hit the little bell notification as well. So this is Daniel Hall signing off. I can't wait to see what you create with your custom GPT builder. Let's go.